what's up guys welcome i'm assuming you guys are really new to python starting out with python and you're probably going around and seeing a lot of like posts that tell you well how do i install this package and they tell you do pip install so you're probably wondering what the hell pip is so in this video i'll show you how to kind of set it up on windows uh first thing first i do assume that you guys have python installed for me it's installed on my c drive so I'm going to go to my C drive and I'm going to find this folder called scripts. I'm going to go inside this folder and here you see we have peep.exe. So that's what we want. So to make this work from command line though, we need to copy this path over here and we'll be basically adding this path to our environment variables. And the way I do this on Windows 10 is probably going to be really similar for you on older versions of windows you just right click on your pc go to properties go to advanced system settings you'll get a window like this go to environment variables here and let's see what i got for python i have my python 2 home set which you all should have set already if not check out the video i show how to do that which is pretty much the same thing as we do in this video um so let's go ahead and create a new variable so the way i do that is click this new button and we're going to call this variable python to scripts and basically i'll just paste the path to my to python scripts yeah that we copied uh, but because i have my python 2 home variable here i'm actually going to do it this way i'm going to say python to home slash scripts click ok oh and by the way guys um i also want to show you that do, 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 the pip does not work right now okay so pip does not work now let me close that actually and now we're going to find a uh, path variable in here so we're looking for path i'm going to click edit and on Windows 10, you'll get a window like this, uh, which is really nice. I mean, this was a major improvement over the previous version. So, but if you are on older version of Windows, you'll get a box kind of like this with, with an edit field. And that field will contain like this long string. That's basically multiple path variables that are in your path variable so what you need to do in this case is go to the very end of that string put a semicolon if there is not one already and then add the variable that you called the uh, that you created for the python scripts uh, directory so in my case it's going to be Python to scripts and put a semicolon there and press enter. Now for those of you who are on Windows 10, all we need to do is go to new over here and just paste in, don't forget the percent signs in the front and at the end, paste that in, click OK click OK, save it. Now, if we open our terminal and we type pip, there we go, we have pip working now. So there you go, guys. Thank you for watching. Make sure to like the video, subscribe and share. Take care.